This is called, I Have Always Worked Hard in America. Okay. Elizabeth Catlett was born in 1915, and three of her grandparents were slaves. She graduated from Hampton University, and then got her master's in fine arts from the University of Iowa. Right after graduating, she won a fellowship which allowed her to go to Mexico. In Mexico City, she joined the Talar Grafica Popular, the most important printmaking workshop in Mexico. Here the artists believed that they could use printmaking to further their political and social goals, such as fighting fascism and illiteracy. Their catlet made a wonderful set of 15 linoleum cuts. This was 1946-47, called The Negro Woman. This is an example of one of them, I have always worked hard in America. Catlett used the three images of the women who are toiling, doing domestic work, to show us how difficult African Americans worked in this country. Here the awkward positions of the women, and look how large the hands are of the woman in the foreground because Catlett would exaggerate physiognomy for expressive purposes. Her goal here was to show how hard African-American women worked and that often the only work they could find was toiling at domestic pursuits or working in the fields. Many of the artists made lino cuts because using a block of linoleum had many advantages. By the way, this was the same linoleum that covered your grandmother's kitchen floor. 